I mean, I, I'm just wondering what happened with Morkvarg. If I take care of Morkvarg, will it smooth things over with the priestesses? Nigh is the time of the sword and axe. None will fight this war in our stead. Nigh is the time of madness and disdain. His long search for Ciri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman. We're back with the Witcher who just got inundated with a bunch of quest updates and information and all kinds of stuff he has to process to determine what he's going to do next. And then there's Morkvarg. What do I do about Morkvarg? Do I just let it go? Do I try to get back into the garden and take care? He, he attacked Geralt. But, uh, and he's cursed. I mean, I guess Geralt's not going to be able to kill him, but... Um, Let's take a look at quests here. The ugly baby. Tell the Baron Sergeant you want to take Uma. I wonder how that's going to go over. I wish the Baron were still alive. It's another reason to wish he was still alive. Geralt knew Uma currently resided at Crow's Perch. The Baron's bandits, hungry for a bit of unrefined entertainment, had made Uma their jester. Geralt knew he would have to put an end to this farce, take the unfortunate being from Velen, and with Yennefer's help, try to lift the curse that held him, or her, as the case may be. Okay, what possession? This is, see, it's a good thing that, um, you know, I call Yen a bitch because, well, she's a bitch, but uh, it's a good thing she uh, took the heat off me here in... Skellige, because I still have a lot I want to do yet here. Um, and I don't know that horse racing is <laughs> a part of that laundry list of things to do. The Hero's Pursuit for the Goddess's Glory. There's more uh, Gwent. Yeah, we can play Gwent here in Skellige. From a land far, far away. On a small isle in Skellige, Geralt found a diary written by refugees from... A oh, that's right. Okay, so there's this little quest. Get rid of the werewolf in the garden. Um, talk to Einar about the curse. Interesting. Um, so if I see this is this is what I while I'm here, this is what I want to concentrate on. What it's, it seems to be suggesting that it's going to let me back in here. But why do I have a talk to Einar about the curse? That would take me over here. Interesting. Um, I never know which which one to do first here. It's like uh, this is kind of if you, if this is one, two, three, you know, this is the next one. All right, let's uh, since we're here, let's get back into the garden if we can. And now, I guess, uh, dead garden. <sighs> so there's no chance of the garden growing back. I mean, they couldn't just. I, Really, Yen did it in that much, like, indefinitely sapped it of any... I mean, the trees look healthy. <laughs> it's not leaves, green leaves. The vines are still green. It's just that center tree didn't come out so well. I think that's where most of the death occurred, yes. Was that alive before I got here? That could very well be. Ah, oh, poor Skjall. I should have um, should have done what I could to um, clear his name. Maybe I can still do that for him. I think I owe him that much for helping Siri and for getting screwed over by Yen at my behest. All right. So where was it? Was down here somewhere? Can you get to Markvark? All right. Back. Over here was where his entrance was, I believe. I think I'm heading in the right direction. We've got... That's old stuff that I was supposed to look at, that I already looked at, I think. Oh yeah, that's his, uh, those are his footprints, right. 
All right, so let's uh, get some verbena and head in. Be nice to get out of the rain. All right, that looks like him up ahead. Oh, what the? Key, Robert. Where's the key? All I have in the Chapter House, the crate, but the key. Where's the key? Ah. Why so silent, Robin? You thief! You rogue! You horse son! You worthless bastard! I will find the key without you, idiot, stupid prick! Okay, um, I don't know why. <sighs> okay, uh, oh, jeez. Man, all right, um, coin up. Igni, um, we, you know what? We need Devil's Puffball for him. Don't, oh, well, we don't need to get backed in there. Okay, let's, um, let's get Cursed Oil on the Silver Sword, sword first of all. There it is. Let's get Devil's Puffball ready to, I think that's what I want to use against him, right? Let's put uh, Superior Devil's Puffball. What is this? This is Grape Shot. This is Dancing Star. Put it in there. Let's just double check to make sure that I'm uh, remembering how I fight werewolves here. I curse ones. Yeah, werewolves. There you go. Yeah, exactly. Moon, oh, Moon Dust Bomb and Devil's Puffball. All right, so let's get Moon Dust. Oops, he's going to attack me while I'm just standing there like a stooge. All right, Moon Dust. Put that where Grape Shot is. Nice. Dodge. I knew he was going to do that. Refresh Gwen. Yeah, yeah. And when I get my stuff together, you're going to be in trouble here. That's all I know. Yeah. Thought you were going to get me there, didn't you? All right. So. Oh, did, he, did I not get that off? Okay. Oh. Alright, let's go with a little coin bubble. Thank you, you're gonna do that a couple more times for me. Okay, one more time would be nice, Morkbarg. Call it even. Now that I've got all my stuff together, and I'm gonna hit you with a... What are you doing, Geralt? Why are you doing that? What the hell? How did I get that chosen? Didn't like that, did you? Right, let's get regular Quen up. And get Igni ready. Get re oh, we killed him. Or we sort of killed him. Interact with him. Willing to talk now? Only now can I. The slash is the curse. <laughs> Makes me bite. Uh, scratch. Mango. <laughs> Till I drop. <laughs> You've got time before the blood's gone from me and, and I return. Listen uh, uh, carefully. Undo, undo the curse. Free me. Uh, finally, I will, I will reward you. Don't like being a werewolf. You mentioned the reward. Finish Mark Borg. Mork Varg off. You mentioned a reward. Yeah, that's what's mentioned a reward of some kind. Looted, raided, drunk most away, all but one. True treasure hid away. Yours just help me. I guess he doesn't like I this is more of a rhetorical question, so, I guess. No joy in being a werewolf. Nay. It's the worst. Not the garden to which I'm bound even. But the hunger. 
say anything, I devour. It turns to ash. Ash. I cannot eat. I cannot drink. Yet I bloody live and roam and prowl. The hunger is terrible. Ah, terrible. I bite my own flesh. But the smallest morsel burns my throat like boiling tar. Everlasting hunger. Classic as curses go. Goes to explain why all those corpses went untouched. Help! Or I'll return to shred you, rip you limb from limb. Um, it does sound pretty awful. And, um, I mean, I guess this is going to go on for all eternity. I mean, I know he was probably terrible as a human before he got cursed, but... I think it's time to end the curse. See what I can do. See and do, or I shall return. Feed Mark Farg? Why would I do that? He's not going to be able to... What do you mean, feed Mark Farg? I'm not going to be able to. Um, is this just like... To kind of prove the theory here? Well, now I gotta know what happens. Oh, what am I, I guess I've got to chew. I've got rotting flesh. I've got raw meat. 36 of them? Do I? No. What the heck? Um, I'm giving him 36 pieces of raw meat. Why didn't I get the option to? What the hell? All right, let's close out of this. We can do this the easy way. Morkvarg, of my own free will, I offer you this fare. Now dig in. Won't turn to ash. Won't well, know until you try. Come on, a spoonful for daddy. Fuck! <laughs> this shite again! Okay, farewell. Farewell. Did I lose all? See Not that I needed that raw meat, but. Okay, what happened? To... Did I get rid of all that raw meat I was carrying? Yeah, it looks like I did. Um, <laughs> whatever. Oops, what do we got here? Werewolf hide, monster essence, werewolf mutagen. Werewolf saliva, werewolf meat. Oh, there I got, I got my raw meat back. Oh, now I'm, I'm so happy. All right, is there anything else to investigate in here? In Morkabarg's lair? There is, what is this? Um, is that something I'm going to fall in? Draft from below. A cave. Okay, there's, there's a level below this, really. Um, that's interesting. Yeah, that's uh, that's who he was talking to there. Polymorphy. All right, let's read this. To change form, to shape one's matter as clay, this is no novice's trick. No flickering glow light or rat-killing blue bolt. Only those with bowels, bowels soaked in oceans of magic arcana, if you are born with bowels so absorbent, can hope to master it. It's <laughs> an interesting limitation. There are exceptions, of course. Dragons, as is well known, possess such a talent innately. With no need for study, they can, guided by some otherworldly intuition, change between humanoid and reptilian form. As for other races, higher vampires, for example, Buxe, hope I'm pronouncing that right, are known to flicker between states. Yet, given the understandable difficulties of conducting research in this area, we do not know if this transition constitutes an acts of, yeah, 
we do not know if this transition constitutes an act of polymorphy. The human race is, obviously, much more accessible to scholars of polymorphy. Their years of study have borne fruit in the form of a set of methods and guidelines for the identification, nurture, and deployment of this talent. The most accomplished result of the careful application of these methods. Philippa Eilhart. Okay. Now, who is this guy he was talking Ideal to? Ideal friend. Patient. Doesn't mouth off. There's a lot of that going on on uh, the, Skelli the Isles of Skellige. Harold Houndsnout. Morkvarg. Okay, so this is going to take me out. We're not ready to leave yet because there's a level below, it seems. It's just a question of how you get to it. And it's not necessarily the case that you get to it from here, I don't think. Well, I am seeing uh, something off in the distance there, lighting up the Witcher senses. All right, I think this is all a dead end, right? Am I, well, wait, what's up here? Oh, okay, that's again, yeah, that's the way out. My Witcher senses want me to go out. There's no doubt about that. Um, there was the gate. Looks like rain. Below my feet. Is that maybe what? Let's see what the update said. Quests, update. Um, find a way into the flooded cave under Morkbarg's lair. Okay, so I think that's saying we need to go over here and play with these damn things again. Right? Because we... What is this? That's just part of the contraption. Okay, let's switch to which one now. If it's not that one over there, it should be... Yeah, there we go. I'm, I'm guessing that I'm on the the right trail here. Okay, do I have to dive? Because I didn't think of doing that before. Hmm. Interesting. Alright, let's get the Witcher senses going. I can't fast swim when I've got the Witcher senses going. Alright, let's lay off the Witcher senses <laughs> before Geralt drowns. All right, nice. Now, is that going to be Morkvarg again? I am going to take a quick second and save the game. All right, let's see what's waiting up ahead. Stop the loot, some clues. It's going to be Morkvarg again. I'm going to have to fight him again, aren't I? Padlock key, okay. Is that the key Morkvarg was going on about? Interesting. Bones fell so, through the crevice years ago. So has he actually been down here or not? And why do we have that more? Can I not examine those remains? All right. Can I examine that? Is that just telling me where the crevice was? Is Brushing right. around here like I know where the heck I'm going. Which I don't. It looks like I've hit a dead end already. So what was the point of coming out oh, of Okay. Um, now I've got the padlock key. I don't know what I use it for though. Yeah, uh, check the quest update. Whoops. Unlock the chapter house doors. Okay, which one was the chapter house again? Can I swim out of here without diving? Geralt sort of automatically dives when he hits a um, dead end, doesn't he? Okay. Uh, surface. And, uh, we'll put the chapter house. Let's put that... Um, so I know where the heck it is. Let's uh, put that on my list there. I choose it, that is. And if I look at the world map, this is the chapter house, right? 
And what is which one is that? That's in wolf's clothing. Get rid of the werewolf in the garden. Okay, so that's he's out here now. Interesting. Let's let's get to the chapter house first. If we can. That was up and over here, I take it. Garden doesn't look completely dead to me. I'm just I'm not buying it. Okay, so this these were the doors. Alright, what am I going to find here? Radavid the fifth, the stern, hard slog to greatness. I have that. Death fog runestone, lesser death fog runestone, and coal. I don't think that was the key. I got a Gwent card. Zeracanian Blinders. Wow, interesting. Fire Elemental, Silver Ore, and Butter. Let's look at um, Inventory. Let's go to Blinders. 60 Horses Fear Level. And what do I have now? I have 40. Okay, so obviously we're going to swap that out. <clears throat> Sarah Canian Horse Blinders. Nice. Roach's fear level should be a little better now. What uh, what was that? Oh, there we go. Quest updated in Wolf's clothing. A sword for witches. We have that. Redanian Lager. Water. Morkvarg's journal, really? Day 24. Chiostar the Wise has proven unworthy of his moniker. He paid me not to attack his village and then, pleased at his own cleverness, called off the watch. Never had easier work, never had easier work in my life. We slit the men's throats in their sleep, plowed the women till dawn. Not much loot, but primo entertainment. Day 26. When we were sailing from... Ronveig, we heard Al's hooting, an ill omen, so I ordered us to turn back to shore. Puka, Pucka, Puck, laughed about how I'm supposed to be so brave, yet I'm afeard of the gods. I tossed him overboard with a knife between his ribs. I could tell I'd lost a bit of respect in the lad's eyes. We'll have to do something to prove I've still got the biggest prick on board, keep them from getting any stupid ideas. Our visit to Hindersfjall was a success. Priestess is dead, monuments smashed, holy to tomes burned, mead barrels drained, we divvied up the silver. I took the votives, Naralf, son of Odlik, took the basins and spoons, Mons, son of Gudvar, took the candlesticks and jewelry, while Einar, son of Torador, forfeited his share out of fear for Freya's wrath. Find all the more for us. Tomorrow we'll sail to Speakerug, see what the merchant wenches have brought to the market. Okay, so uh, Morkvarg was a uh, was a bit of a uh, what would be the term a reaper, something like that. He was a bit of a, a bit of a pirate. The Einside and the Ein L. I think I have this, but. Sad as it may be, to many in our time, the word elf is a synonym for pauper, bandit, or a layabout. She-elf is used by many to denote prostitute or woman of loose morals. The adjective elven, in turn, describes damage, needlessly complicated, or useless goods. Statistics, for their part, show that one in three elves living in Redania has spent time in prison, and a full one-half of them have been fined at least once. The average lifespan of elves, though still thrice that of humans, grows shorter each year. Given the above, it is easy to forget that elves, or Einside, as they fashion themselves, were once a proud race that ruled the lands, stretching from the banks of the Great Sea in the west to the Blue Mountains in the east, and from the Dragon Mountains in the north to the Mahakam Range in the south. The ruins of their cities, scattered throughout the known world, bear witness to their former might. Capi Monumenta Elf. Forum, or uh, something, what is CP? Yeah, I forget what that stands for. By Istred of Eid Ginvel. 
Many of the most outstanding mages, artists, and poets of recorded history have been of this race. And we have elves to thank for dozens of ingenious items we rely on each day, from screw pumps to cosmetics. Those elves who dwell amongst men have largely forgotten their history and culture. The sole sil sliver of elven identity left in them being a burning hatred for humans, whom they refer to as Doin, Duan, Duan. <laughs> I should know the pronunciation by now. The elves of Dolblathana, that puppet vassal of Nilfgaard, and of the wild highlands of the Blue Mountains have retained much of their old knowledge and cultur culture, though they too are condemned to perish. This death sentence was handed to them by biology, for men, though short-lived, are several times more fertile than elves. Thus, while the Einside's numbers continue to dwindle, ours grow at an alarming and ever-increasing rate. Some elves believe that the tide of events can be turned, that they can put a stop to human expansion and ultimately to their oppression by men. They look to their mystical cousins for salvation to the Ein El, the Alder Folk. They look to their mythical cousins for salvation. I wonder, um, are the Ein El the Wild Hun? Hmm, the Alder Folk. The Ein El are said to dwell in another world or possibly another plane to which they traveled during the mythic age of migration and from which they at times journey to visit our world. Legend claims a gate between the worlds could be opened, allowing the Ein El to ride their downtrodden brethren, ride to their downtrodden brethren's brethren's rescue. These are, however, mere fables. Naive fairy tales this race condemned to extinction uses to provide itself small comfort in these their last sad moments. Okay, so um Siri supposedly has the blood of elves in her. We've got Wild Hunt coming from another dimension, and now we've got a book that hints at elves from another dimension coming to save the elves in this one. There's something along another world, another something. And we've got Morkvarg's true. What is glowing like that right there? Oh, it's just something catching. Wow, that was that bottom of that bottle caught the torchlight just right. That is very interesting. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. So now um, we have the werewolf in the garden, but we have Einar to talk about the curse. All right, let's. Um, how did we get to the garden again? Was it not? I don't think we can get to it this way. Um, it was, I believe. Did we not have to go over that? Let me let me just. Uh, Look on the world map before I continue to guess here. We have another... Oh, that's the well, right? Entrance to a cave or... That must be indicating the well, right? We have to... Yeah, we have to go this way, I think. Where we originally met him? Do we not? Oh, we never opened this. And the key isn't going to open it either, is it? That's unfortunate. Oh, it does. Okay. Thank you for the key. And that... No, there is another... There's another entrance indicated here. What is this? And can I see around the damn vines for a second to... What are we indicating here? Okay, I thought Geralt was in a mood, but once again my controller disconnected on me. It didn't like the fact that I found this here. On fiber. Um, I don't... Morkvog doesn't give up easily. Oh, I did see this before, but I never, never went in. Is there any way... Morkvog doesn't give up easily. Yeah, I get it. I get it, Geralt. What we want to do is we want to try to unlock it. All right, so we need a different key for that. That's what Morkvog was talking about. Got it. Okay, so he wasn't talking about the chapter house. He wants into there for some reason. Um, we got to get a key for that somewhere, I guess. But right now, we've got to find him. Ooh, did a light just go out over there? Did I imagine that? I thought I saw a light in that window, but I could have totally imagined that. What is what is over here? I don't remember any 
exploring any of that. That's all quite interesting down there. If I went down there, would I get back up? And why would I go down there? Is there any reason? Alright, <laughs> um, hop umbles, hop umbles, on fiber. That's where we met him originally. It doesn't look like I'm supposed to go that way. Looks like I'm supposed to go this way. I opened it. Okay, this key is doing a lot for me, but... Now it's telling me to go back the way I came. What the hell? Alright, that's the entrance to more... Alright, so we've got... Now we've got connection between these two places. Um, where the hell is it telling me to go? Oh, it's telling me sort of the main garden. All right, now that wasn't what I was indicating before, was it? Or did I just get, did I get turned around? Oh, there he is, okay. Interesting, hello again. Um, I understand that this is fruitless, but the uh, quest is making me do it. You understand, right? Personal And I've got the right bombs selected now, right? <laughs> got superior moon dust. Okay, and I've got three of them. Where did he go? Alright, let's hit him with a bomb. What does that do to him, by the way? Does that blind him? Alright, um, let's get Quen back up. And thankfully, we took. Uh, let's get Igni ready. Another bomb. I don't know how the hell I missed him, but I did. Alright, let's just igni him and see what happens. Alright, so... <laughs> killed him again. Here we are again. <laughs> Too kind. End this. Or release me. Okay. This is really getting pointless. I've got to go see you. Well. See you soon. Okay, so we get we got another pile of werewolf remains to mute. To mute. To loot. <laughs> werewolf mutagen, werewolf saliva, werewolf meat. Why is there why is there an exclamation mark next to what do I need that for another quest? Why is there... Where's the current quest items? Werewolf meat. Item needed to complete... I wish it would tell me which quest. Morkbarg's journal. Journal. Ready for additional. You've already read this. Okay. What do I need werewolf meat for? Um, okay. Let's go see Einar if we can. Can I get out the um, uh, front door? Where is the front door again? <laughs> Can I find the front door and get out that way? That's not it. Um, where the hell is the front door to this place? It's like in this direction, right? And we want to go down there to get rid of the werewolf. No, we're not playing to get rid of the werewolf in the Garden Again game. That's, that's just unending. We're getting to the front door, which means I need to make a right turn and go this way. And will the key open the front door? No. That key does that. I guess maybe that's what um, Mark Bard was looking for. Maybe. I mean, oh, that was unfortunate, wasn't it? <laughs> and I mentioned in previ previous episodes that a platform gamer, I am not. Ah, uh, The least I could do is bury you, but apparently I'm not going to be able to. Okay, that's a dead end. Alright, let's go this way. There are nice polite stairs down this way. Are there not? Yep, there are. Now, where is Larvik? Because that's where I have to meet Yen. I suppose I should know where Larvik is, but I don't. That's Lafaten. Is this Larvik over here? 
I guess there's a way to sort of cheat here, is there not? Let's go to the main quest. No, because it doesn't... Huh. Meeting Yen now is not part of the main quest? Quest? Uh, the Last Wish. This is Meet Yen in Larvik. Before Geralt and Yennefer parted after their adventure in Freya's garden, the sorceress asked him to meet her in Yarvik. Larvik. <sighs> she made it clear this was a personal matter, but gave no further details. So just wanted to look at the world map. Yeah, it's okay. So we've got uh, two things to do in Larvik even though it's not mentioned on my map yet. Let's get back to um, in Wolf's Clothing. No, 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 we're doing this one. Okay, let's go see Einar. Now, who is Einar? Have I, in all of the stuff that I've gotten in the garden, was Einar mentioned? Probably was, and I'm just being a blockhead here. I'm not remembering it. All right, what's off in that? I just gotta know what's off in that direction. Oh, there's a um, alchemy supplies. Really? Oh, speaking of which, let's take a second here. And I should have done this about ten episodes ago. Let's uh, make way fell. And I don't see what Redanian Herbal does for me otherwise, so we might as well make... I'll leave one Redanian Herbal for some strange reason. And now I can make... I can make both of these. Superior Thunderbolt. And superior white Rafford's decoction. Okay, wonderful. And uh, all right, what? What else did we? You know, we just had oils that I need a bunch of stuff for, mostly cockatrice's stomach and arenary eyes and all that good stuff. Um, and none of these decoctions I can make, but I have so many decoctions that I don't take now. I can make more in Vermilion and waste my white gull, but I'm going to hold off. I can make all this. Is there anything obvious? Is there any oils that I'd like to make that are missing something stupid? Nope. Cockatrice stomach. Cockatrice stomach. Uh, this is like a... Oh, you know what? Though? Those were... Actually, those were um, Cape Troll livers. All right. Cockatrice stomach. What are you missing? You're missing green moss and Cabreth, and that is superior hangman's but that's pretty important all right i need an arenaria eye arenaria arenia eye <laughs> i need to learn to pronounce words in Geralt's universe agroid oil i really need this and i need i need like three cave unfortunately i'm going to be like farming out cave trolls it's kind of obnoxious Enhanced relic oil. I, haven't, I don't have the... Uh, oh, no, wait. I'm waiting on the cave. Okay, so none of that is simple. We're waiting on um, some pretty fresh and precious ingredients. And uh, I'm going to save the game again. All right, Carol. Off to it. I believe this is long group, though. So, nope. Oh, puffball. All right. Did I want to go see... what? How is my carry weight looking? Do I want to go see... Do I have anything? See, this really is armor and, um, and, <clears throat> excuse me, blacksmith stuff. Don't imagine an alchemy supplier is going to be terribly interested in that. But it could be, it's telling me to go off into the woods. This could be a bad choice, could it not? I probably should have followed the, uh, oh, it's taking me sort of, Cutting the corner in the uh, road is it not? What do we have here? Hmm. Not much left. Beast must have dragged the shredded body to the woods. 
Contract, strange beast. All right, I suppose we're gonna get that at the um, notice board here in Marvik. Something really did tear him to pieces. Okay, sorry buddy, but I'll be back. I've, I'm on quest overload. If you can hear me in the afterlife, I'm sure you understand. And look at that amazing view. He says, looking over the dead body at the Skellige Mountain Range. All right, so somewhere in this area, there is a big, mean, nasty monster that needs some Witcher solutions applied to it. Barbicane fruit. All kinds of stuff. To, am I high enough up to get police fruit now? I probably am not, but um, let's just poke our nose here and there and see if we get we get lucky. I won't uh, I won't go full on harvest mode, but um, I just I don't know what elevation I'm at. And I think a couple episodes ago I called it latitude rather than altitude. Ah, oh, my vocabulary failing me while I'm playing video games. It's, Embarrassing. Oh, let's enhance our weapons. Nice. So we have an armor here, which at 1 a.m. is not, he's not, talk to Thorleaf. That name sounds familiar. Fine, fine. <laughs> fine, fine. That really sounds familiar. And we have a uh, enhancement bench too. Nice. All right. Now, why is it, um, okay, got a fast travel post. We've got, um, where, how do I get to Einar? Before I do that, let me hit the notice board. Now, I assume Yen's inside the tavern. Okay, sailing west, hark ye good men, come Lamus. Again, hoping I'm pronouncing that right. I am setting out to the west with Grittier, Grettir, and Finborn, Finbjorn. The elders say there is nothing out there but sea, krakens, and serpents, but I'm a man who has to see for himself to believe. If you are up for an adventure, we still have a few oars free. Okay, so they're going to sail to the edge of the world, I guess. Gardar's death. Gardar, son of Hakan, died during the last raid. His breast was pierced with three arrows, but he managed to crush the bowman's head in his hands, I know that urge, before he drew his last breath. Body already buried, buried in a baroque. Baroque? Is that just ba is supposed to be barrow without the K? But his spirit is feasting with his ancestors. Pour some mead in his memory sometime. Garuta. Ragnarug. I feel as though I read this on another notice board. Ragnarug is coming, and if it's Rag, oh, oh well, what are you going to do? Sharpen your swords, hone your fighting skills, conquer your fear when the golden cockerel combi cra there it is. When Hemdall rises up, who is Hemdall? <laughs> uh, a few episodes ago, I was crowing about my love for the Combi and Hemdall card, and I know nothing about them, honestly. When the Rainbow Bridge opens for the Giants, the sons and daughters of Skellige must be ready for battle. Contract Morkvarg. Sons and daughters of Freya, another year has passed in which Morkvarg plagues our goddesses' gardens. Well, don't worry about that, they're dead now. Whoever musters, not the goddesses, the, the goddess... The gardens, I think everybody understood what I meant there. Whoever musters the courage to eliminate this evil will gain fame amongst mortals and the favor of the immortals, as well as a prize from the temple's vault. So, so I wonder if she's going to give that to me now. Ooh, that would be pretty brazen to go collect that uh, reward, wouldn't it? Sons and daughters of Skellige, when you catch a shark, it is unbecoming to take only the fins and drop the rest of it. You know... Same thing happens in another world. That is awful. Such wastefulness is an insult both God is an insult to, I guess, both gods and nature. The body of every killed creature, whether weasel or whale, has to be used in its entirety to the last bone intended Ermion. That's those are wise words, Ermion. Monster on the high road, I need a hero, a man favored by the gods or a witcher. <laughs> so you're saying the witchers are not heroes or favored by the gods? That's a god backhanded uh, insult of everyone that ever I saw one. Anyone, really, who's not afraid to stand up to the ghastly creature that's been attacking folk walking the main road to Larvik. A reward's been set aside. If you do not fear death and long for fame in ballads, come see the village elder, Thorleaf, son of the bear hugs, as in bear hugs, 
P.S. Sferi, you stay home. <laughs> You've done enough as it is. Okay. Um, is Einar going to be up at this time of day? And how the hell do I get to Einar? I think, do I just have to follow the road? Is it like a switch, switch back and it takes me down? No, I passed the quest available. Interesting. I passed by the opportunity to go down there. So let's uh, backtrack here. And let's take a look at that quest available as we head. There's somewhere... Oh. Quest available up in the map. How am I going to get to that? I'm sure it was a left turn. Uh, yeah. How the heck do I get to that? Is that like a little crook in the mountain here? And I don't want to pass the woo, 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 woo. Wolf's vein. Come on, Geralt. You can do it. Ah, there we go. Talk warrior. Who are you? Why are you here? Could ask you the same. Places like this? Usually home to necrophages alone. They're corpse eaters, aye. And they grow bolder by the day. Crawl out to attack the living. We'll kill them all. Clear the mine with our swords in our hands. Honor our fathers and do them so. Um, yeah, I can help you. I'm a witcher. I've got some time Could before go the morning. You and help. To go see Ina. the glory to us. No chance. Glory won't do much for you if ghouls are gnawing on your bones. <laughs> Mm. Plunk you him in the it helmet. Makes sense. Hmm. All right, you lead the way then. Oh, suddenly we went for <laughs> me not having any part of it to me leading the way, huh? Okay. Uh, inventory. Uh, because he said necrophages, I'm going to assume I need superior necrophage oil. Thank you very much. All right, get some uh, so am I easy there, warrior. <laughs> yeah, you were shot out of a cannon, huh? Okay, we got ghouls, coin up, and um, igni, and let me hit them. Let me hit them with a bomb to start off. Let's hit them with northern wind, and then we'll go in and let them have it. Get northern wind back. On my bomb list there, nice. And um, let's see if I've got, I've got it chosen even. Let's let them have it. Oh, they dodged it. Tricky buggers. Oh no, got one. Thank. Whoa, we've got devourers. We got all kinds of stuff going on here. Oh, get out of there, Geralt. Get out of there. I couldn't. Disconnect from the kill move. He do not go into kill move mode with uh, devour, please. Okay, is that everything? No, because they're they're heading on to the next. They are shot out of a cannon, and we got one who's about to die. Okay, now is that everything? Um, looks like it. Last one. Drag the corpses outside. Burn them. Other ghouls don't scorn their cousins' corpses. Aye. True. It's good you came. Seems Freya watches or us to have let you here. We're grateful. And will be for long. <coughs> okay, Folk yeah, that's grateful is one thing, but, uh, so reward is, uh, Aye. another thing there, Helmet Head. Sorry. After glow of the battle, we're still caught up. Damn you, slice them good. Here, for you. Thanks. Farewell. Two experience points. You no respect for our customers. <laughs> Not you, nor 60 that crowns. All right, yeah, you guys take care of that stuff. I'll take care of this stuff. Quest completed for fame and glory. Arbitrator relic, fiber, and nails. Okay. What do we got? Oh yeah, right. Uh, lesser Green Mutagen, Monster Blood, Monster Ear, Al Ghul Claw, Al Ghul Bone Marrow. So it mushroom. Friends okay. with show heart. Football, so it mushroom. Hey, where are you going? I'm leaving. You guys are taking care of this. I'm not staying to help drag the corpses out. Thank you for drawing my attention to this though. Powder pearl, leather straps. 
Timber, Glyph of Axie, Pig Hide, and a Ruby. Yeah. Thanks for breaking my attention. That was very useful. Hey, where you going? Yeah, we tried that trick already. Strabag Runestone, Marana Runestone, Florence. Once again, I have to find somewhere to uh, Venom Extract, Ghoul's Blood, Puffball. To exchange all the Florins I'm getting, Puffball. What's the exchange rate? I never did find that out. Suant Mushrooms. Lesser blue mutagen, lesser blue mutagen. Puffball, we've got a ladder up. That's interesting. Monster tongue, devourer's blood. Cotton, dark iron ore, suet mushrooms. Monster tongue, devourer's blood. A chest. Dimeridium ingot. Now, is that more expensive than dimeridium ore? More valuable, that is. Venom Extract, Ghoul's Blood, Puffball, Suin Mushroom, and some kind of raised platforms that do, don't have a way up to them. Doesn't look like I can go. I don't know that I'm going to be able to get up there. Uh, do I, is there anything? Oh, maybe we will. No, doesn't look like it. Oh, there we go. Is there anything up here worth... Nothing's triggering the old Witcher sentence. So, oh, jeez, Geralt, I'm sorry. That, I should have... <laughs> Very sorry about that, Geralt. Let's have some water. Let's have some bread. And I think it's going to take a little more food than that to get him back 100%, but um, yeah. Suet mushrooms. Is there anything up there? Oh, look at this stuff. Pickaxe. Did I need a pickaxe? Pick Did I need two pickaxes? Can we use this? We cannot. Um, Geralt's probably thinking I'm going to make him jump down from up above anyway, so he's not interested. Suant mushrooms, suant mushrooms, mix, running past them, suant mushrooms, a lot of suant mushrooms, are they not? No end to the little mushrooms. Hardened leather. Don't know that I needed that, but okay. Dimeridium ore, I didn't need that. Dimeridium ore. I've got to find somebody to buy that from me because it's doesn't seem, unless like when I get to the gazillionth level, I need it for uh, armor and stuff. That might be the case. Some kind of um, magic resistant armor. That'd be pretty cool. Make that out of dimeridium ore. Okay, I promised I wasn't going to go off on a uh, harvesting binge. So let me keep my promise. Are you an early riser, Einar? I need you to be. Am I pronouncing your name correct? Where do these stairs go? Back up. Was there a stairs down from the village? And I didn't realize it. Celandine, Moranagrin, and Warrior. Which one of you is Einar? Warrior. Something I've always wondered. What will you witchers do once there are no gods? Fuck Einar. Yara, you dimwit. Drop one more and I'll keel haul you. Got a minute? Prepare my boat, can't you see? Nelf Guardian dogs were to hunt us some. Got bigger game in mind. Mork Varg. Ah, so them's your apples. All right, ask away. In praise of Freya. Garden, what happened? Are you not going to have any information for me? Um. Okay, well, let's start there. You were there when Morkvarg raided the garden. Heard you alone survived. True. I managed to flee. Great Mother was looking out for me that day. Mm -hmm. Bet she didn't give a lick about the priestesses. Apparently. Morkvarg had them bound and slit their throats like horses for the sacrifice. And he laughed. Understand? He laughed. And I'm raising this guy's... Curse because they're lifting this but curse. But Archpriestess Over cursed him with her dying breath. 
You are beastly now. Remain so forevermore. Ah, saintly one. Liar. Why do you suspect he's lying? Um, you saw the journal. Oh, okay, because he didn't help the priestesses. Didn't help the priestesses? Why not? How could I? Alone against a dozen raiders that... Why are you staring? Just wondering. You people, obsessed with honor, courage, and so on. Are you just cut and run? Strange. I ain't proud of it. Since that day, I've been seeking a worthy death at sea. Seems the goddess, she's not seen fit to summon me. Yet. Okay, what happened to Morkvarg? What happened to Morkvarg? Hard to believe, but fur rose through his skin, and his mug stretched forth into a muzzle, like a dog's or a wolf's. He howled, long and grieving, then lunged at his men. They tried to run, but he was fast as lightning. As he killed them, clamped his jaws round their throats, they turned to ash, just like that. Ash that seeped from twixt his fangs. Not good. Curse must be complex, multi-leveled. Such is the Great Mother's power. Okay, I still think he's a liar. All right. Liar. What? <laughs> I swear it on the Great Mother's tits. Cut the act. Don't buy your piety one bit. You were one of Morkvarg's men. Well, well. Sharp yarn. Didn't see one thing, though. You're going Lads to attack here me. around me. They're mine. Arm to the teeth to the man. Let me introduce you. Yes, you're going you. to attack me. Okay. Uh, I'll meet them gladly. Can't wait. You're daft. You're alone. What's your plan, eh? Let me show you. <sighs> Okay, so here goes. We've got to uh, kill the entire docks. Nice. I guess that's my plan. Inventory, Hangman's Venom. And that is... where is that now? It is here. It's still just enhanced Hangman's Venom. And, um, yeah. Can dodge. What is that guy trying to attack me with? Okay, uh, Igni. Pathetic. If I just kill Einar, could that be the end of it? Like, I don't know that I want to kill everybody. Igni, dodging. All right, can you guys help me out with... Oh, you got a big axe. You're not going you got a big hammer. I don't think you're going to help me with, uh... Are you going to help me with, uh... Friend Bubble? You have, uh, you might... Come on, come in. All right, nice. Can we do that again? Did I get Einar already? You missed. Oh, okay. You sort of helped me, but you're not. Oh. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, that is helping, but not helping. Okay. Uh, Carol, can you get up there? There you go. Can you attack me instead of the other guy? There you go. Okay, well now we're talking. Let's go up the stairs. Let's get regular Quen up. Igni ready. Okay. You didn't have the big hammer though. I'm gonna have to uh, repost with you. Am I not? Let's Did I put dance. a bomb down? What the hell had just happened there? Yeah, your shield is irritating me. What happened to the other guy? Did I kill him with, yeah, the guy with the big hammer. I think Einar is the first one I took out. All right, let's do some reposting here. Come on. You and your damn sword, or shield. Okay. That's the end of you. Do we want to talk to the drunk? <laughs> okay, he's taking that gruesome scene pretty well. Roasted chicken leg. Crown, Skellige Longsword. String, Skellige Longsword. 
and just Einar's loot is left, right? Fried meat, hatchet, cursed fang. Really? Um, what does that mean? Do I have, did I get a quest update? Get rid of the werewolf in the garden. Hmm. Okay, what, um, is that part of my quest items now? It sure seems to be. Item needed to complete a quest. Cursed Fang Other. Why would INR have a Cursed Fang, and why would it help me lift the curse over Morkvarg? Um, okay. Let's talk to Yen. Let's make that the preferred quest. And um, then we'll go see Morkvarg. And let me take a second and save again. All right, so I assumed she's in the inn. Don't know that that's going to be. Yes, she is. Okay. <laughs> you guys have been drinking all night, haven't you? What is she doing? Seriously? You, they're a bunch of local knuckleheads. What are you doing? Always did know how to win, friends. I was provoked. Mm -hmm. So it happened. Wanted to talk to me about something? Amos Far Ipsis. A specialist on jinns. Heard of him? I found a tome he'd penned oh, in the Emperor's Library. I know what this is about, Yen. Yeah. set off for Skellige one day and was never heard from again. I asked some of the local folk. Some here still remember him. I know why she's interested, but we need to hear the Why are story. you even interested? Jinns are dangerous sometimes, and malicious all the time. I remember. But the advantages outweigh the risks. If I can tame a jinn, I shall gain incredible power. And that could be useful to us one of these days. Okay, do you know where to look? Know where to look? For the mage and the djinn? The locals say they last saw Amos's ship off the coast of Hindisfjall, just before a once in an eon storm broke. Dad will find them then. Mage is probably fish food, and the djinn escaped. Not necessarily. But even if it is so, I'll not give up without seeing some evidence. Will you help me? I've no gold to offer in reward, but I shall be ever so grateful. Um. Now, see, here's the thing. This turned out very poorly in the books, you going after a djinn. <laughs> in fact, I think it destroyed like a whole town, or at least part of it. Um, but she did do me the solid of uh, lying to the sorceresses or the priestesses that it was all your idea in the garden, which allows me to continue to adventure throughout Skellige, so I do owe you one. Fine, I'll help. Since you put it that way, fine, I'll help you. Thank you. A boat awaits in the harbor. Come. Uh, no, we're not coming right now. Hey, listen. Come again? Uh, we're doing this now? No, no, we can't do this now. Quests. Go to Larvix Harbor with Yen. Um, now she said she wasn't going to wait. I, I got to go take care of Morkbard. That I have to do at least. Um, so I last managed to prepare everything already. I have. How could you possibly know I'd agree? I didn't. Decided to risk it. Um, I have a feeling if I don't go with her though, this what quest is this now? The last wish. Go to Larvae. Um, yet when Yen, let's see, before Geralt and Yennefer parted after their adventure in Freya's garden, the sorceress asked him to meet her in Larvik. She made it clear this was a personal matter, but gave no further details. Ger Geralt duly traveled to Larvik, where Yennefer revealed to him her plan. She intended to capture a djinn and draw on its power. Brr, the very thought of it makes my skin crawl and my throat constrict. For, dear reader, I have had the misfortune of dealing with a djinn once in my life, and I assure you... See, this is a thing. Dandelion. 
was all part of that original gin, gin story in the book with the end. Once was one time too many. Most gins you see combine incredible power with a mean streak a mile long. In short, they are nasty beings that prudent people should steer well clear of. Yet when Yennefer sets her sights on something, there's no turning back. Carol Glumley realized this and decided to help her handle the dangers that would surely arise during this mad endeavor. endeavor. Yennefer had managed to learn about a certain scholar who had devoted his entire life to delving into the secrets of jinns. He died in mysterious circumstances during a shipwreck off the coast of Hindersfjall. That is where Geralt and Yennefer decided to begin their search. Now, I'm afraid this is going to tear me away from Skellige. And um, I'm going to get, get going back to see Amir. Like, it's just going to be a cascade of getting involved with Yen rather than Lead getting involved with Skellige. Just which once, I... you might try to take the initiative. Would you even let me? It would depend on the situation. Um, it just, it's going to be Yen from here on in. But I suppose, you know, if I, what does it say? Quest updated, quests. Talk to Yennefer. Can I keep her in suspended animation, so to speak? I'm going to try to Geralt, see over here. and solve this Morkvark quest first. Let's make that our chosen quest. And we're going to hope when we return dealing with Morkvarg, she's still going to be standing there, ready to talk, and not extremely irritated. <laughs> 